think when I first started my brand, it was more than just creating a collection. It was having the experience of working in this industry. I really wanted to create an atmosphere that was more organic and more definitely like a family that really everyone is invested in the brand and we really work great collectively. My background was a little bit of oddball, I mean, amongst a bunch of students that were studying mostly drawing and painting. Um, I've always been about dimension and mixing medias. I guess that kind of correlates with my passion for design and fashion because it's very about creating a story and atmosphere for not just the story but for the clothing to live in. I've been calling my inspiration this season East Meets West for nightcaps. So it's a little bit of a sinister seduction and the approach this season was very cinematic from the music to the mood of the clothing, the color changes. It's a mix of film noir, there's a feeling of a little bit of griminess but in a beautiful way. always about adding as much dimension as you can possible and working with Swarovski elements I think it's especially important this season even though certain things are conceptually complicated they're in appearance they look very clean so details like crystals or crystal mesh really bring out the facets and the shapes. With every collection I always want things to appear the same way a collage does, that the closer you get to it, the more intrigue there is in the piece. It's about luxury and high-end detail and making it better by the embellishment. And there's depth to it, and I feel like that's a lot in line with what the Swarovski brand is about. For the future, like I said, I'm really patient, but uh, even myself, I have a very mixed wardrobe of menswear and it's always been a passion of mine so if, you know, as, as it takes off I'd love to start that as well. And accessories are growing every season so um, it's, it's a very slow and patient growth in every, every area.